Hi, I'm Todd Whitthorne, the president of ACAP Health, alongside our chief medical officer, Dr. Tim Schertz. An exciting day because JOEM, the Journal of Occupational Environmental Medicine, recently published a study looking at a very large population, the impact that Naturally Slim has on blood pressure. Tell us about the study. Well, as you know, a lot of the employers we work with like to do pre and post testing after Naturally Slim. We took the data from 93 of those employers, six thousand individuals in this data set so it's not a small data set and what we found is that in individuals who lose five percent or more of their weight over 50 percent of them are no longer in that high blood pressure category they've moved into that normal blood pressure category so that naturally slim program the folks are losing weight but obviously having a very direct impact on blood pressure no absolutely and i think it's a i think it's a variety of things it's clearly the weight a lot of them are becoming physically active and a lot of them are just eating healthier so when, when average consumers think about weight, they, they think in pounds, pounds lost. In research science, we, we look at percent of weight loss, and 3 to 5% always indicates that you're moving in the right direction. That's what you saw here. And that's exactly what the national guidelines say. The weight loss treatment guidelines specifically say, hey, there's benefit to your health with as little as 3%, but you want to go closer to 5%. And that's what we get with Naturally Slim. And for most people, that's 10, 12 pounds, right? It's about 10 or 12 pounds. There's a lot of risk factors for health. Why is blood pressure so important? Specific to the employer, and this is fascinating to me. I don't claim to totally get it, but of all the risk factors we're used to talking about, um, cholesterol, blood pressure, diabetes, high blood pressure is probably the strongest predictor of future healthcare costs there is. Wow, very, very impressive. Well, it's a great study. If you'd like to read it, you can actually just go to the Naturally Slim website, click on the news section. You can also find it at what's called PubMed. The publications of all medical publications that you'll find virtually worldwide lives at pubmed.gov. Our government will house over 25 million papers there. So if you like this kind of stuff, you want to dig in and get a little geeky, that's a great place to go, pubmed.gov. Thanks for joining us.